Hi there, so I'm back to do part four, stroke B. <laughs> so um, in part four A, um, <laughs> we've just got a little bit of, of collage down, mainly to uh, cover um, some of the, oh, you know, the text what's already on envelopes sometimes, because uh, a lot of these are used envelopes. And just to put a little bit of paper, um, onto the background. I think I'm gonna to have to probably make another um, tag because I knew that that had split, but I wasn't, I didn't realize it had split uh, that much. So for now, I'm just gonna <coughs> rip, rip that down. Um, what am I gonna do with this? I'll put it over there. Okay, so I am going to do a little bit of stenciling. Like I said, I've not really got a lot of background stencils. So I've got this like flourish one from Tim Holtz. Yeah, and I've got um, this one, which is a little bit like Damask, isn't it? I suppose it is Damask. And I've got one of the um, messy ink ones. Uh, that was from In Love Arts. Um, I had a try at stenciling through this Daco uh, ribbon. It's um, a burlap um, ribbon. I think it is called uh, Web, something Web. It is on my Amazon uh, favourites list if you want to, you know, get the proper what it's called. And it came out pretty well. I think I'm going to stencil in, I've got a few mementos out. So I've got um, the London Fog, Summer Sky and Danube Blue. And I'm also going to use the Stays On Timber Brown for um, the splatters. So let me just... I've broke my medium makeup brush um, and I feel like the next size up is a little bit too too big. So let's just, let me show you this. I was quite impressed with that. Yeah, I've been like looking around the house. I mean, I was going to bring a colander up and <laughs> do some through a colander. Um, but yeah, I just thought that that would just visually look, look bizarre. So... I'm gonna look at that. I think that's fab. So yeah, I think <laughs> you could possibly look around and and find some things to get some kind of um, imprint on. I'm sure you can do it with bubble wrap as well, can't you? But I don't know if the ink would have to be. Um, wetter so yeah I really like that I think I just want to do this <laughs> all the way through it and I'm loving <coughs> that colour <clears throat> some tanning I don't know if some of it will get covered over by uh, you know whatever we're gonna do next but yeah I really like that so I'll carry on with the blue on this side and then I'll change it up a bit so I'm actually going to leave this in with my uh, stencils to remind me um, that I can use that but um, yeah I have been looking at some stencils with this kind of um, background and and stuff so I do want to do some you know with the texture paste and things so I have been uh, looking so I want to put the lid on with that this is only a printout so I'm just gonna <coughs> rub my brush over here just to try and get rid of um, some of the some of the darkness so I'm going to go back and see if I can add any um, of the timber brown. I don't really want to do that with a same brush. I'm going to have to try and do it with this um, bigger brush. So let's just get a little bit of 
Oh gosh, that's dark. Oh, that looks okay. Let's just put a little bit here. Let's see. Yeah, I like that. I'm going to try and not put any more ink, ink on it. So that's that. And we'll have a, a splat over here. Yeah, super duper. So let's just put that lid back on. Now, oops. Let me fussy cuts from something else. What? What I'm up to. Um, I don't know if to now go back and and add some more colour. Um, or will that be too much? Let's think where I could put it. Maybe, maybe this bit here. That's um. This grey one is a little bit dark. Uh, not dark. Uh, it's it. Oh, I can't talk. It's never been very wet since since I got it. Right, which piece did I want that piece? So it will be probably quite quite faint, which is fine. Just. Add A little bit down there so yeah I like that so um, got some got some more I think I want it I think I'm just gonna add some across that top Hard to, to get into it with the with my book being quite small. So yeah, that's fine. Right, might as well start off with the grey album, my seeing as and that's what I'm on. Right, shall we do something else? I don't suppose it really <coughs> really matters. Right, do this bit here. Oh, I like that. And let's see if we can get another twirly bit in. Probably need some more ink on. Yep. And that's that. And then, oh, come on, I'm brushless. That's for the brown, isn't it? Let me do a little bit of. Um, I think I'm just going to have a bit of a coffee stain there. It's being mindful of where the page actually stops. So that's that. Anyone see where my lid is? It's over here. Right, shall we have a go at the summer sky? I'm just gonna see if we can take some of that off. And I'm gonna go in with this. Where shall I put it? Can I have some? Or is it this one what's really dry? I know one of them's really dry because that grey actually looked, looked okay. Oh, this looks okay as well. I love that. Right, I'm going to try and get some 
<coughs> across this top bit. Know. it's a bit hard to tell if it's on or not well it's give give a bit of something um i don't think i want any on that side so i've got here try and get some in that corner okay there. yeah and let's go in darker blue going with this bit of flourish oh yeah I like that so let's have one over here too A bit hard to dab into when when this small, but the perfect for you know I don't do a lot of inking and you can pick them up. I mean I've bought some at just over a pound. Uh, some of the colours, so they are very good. Um, you know for having some colours in your stash and not going uh, crazy. So I tend to, when I do a new project, I'll like buy a couple of matching inks. Um, so yeah, it's quite nice. Right, do we want, I'm not going to put, um, that's quite off-putting, isn't it? <laughs> when you look at it, that's, that's the card. Um, I feel like I do want some brown. I don't know where though. If I can just get these um, little ones, it's a lot of taking lids on and off, isn't it? Goodness gracious! Okay, yeah, I like that. I just feel like I want just a few over there. Can't really see them, but that's fine. Okay, all right, what's next? Oh, like this. <clears throat> yeah, that's nice. Um, I'll just have some across that corner. Wonder if we're gonna go in with like washi tapes and I suppose that's it. Um a final um kind of thing. So yeah, I'm liking that. I think I'm gonna have some of the grey. I think I'm just going to do it across that, that corner. Let's get that lid on. That's there. And that's there. Okay. <laughs> Why I've got the lid off this, I might as well. I think I'm gonna have a big coffee ring there. So let's try and get Yeah, I like that. Do I want any grey on here? That's um see that but that's just another another bash yeah I still can't see it <laughs> it's 
still can't. Right, let's um, have a, a nice coffee ring here. Oh, I can't set there. So I don't really want to go onto the window, but I imagine I can put it in stays on, can't I? Because it stays on. <laughs> Oh dear. Oh, I like that. That looks like some strong uh, like espresso coffee. It's going to fade that out a little bit. Yeah, I like that. Um, I think I'm going to have some splatters up here, seeing as the... Um, what side that's supposed to go, really? I've got to stay to the same side, Kosa. Okay, so, um, I'll get it on something. I'm just going to dab those. Yeah, I like that. I feel like it just needs a bit um, of Danu Blue. Um, Shall we have a bit of a flourish? Okay, so I'm fine with that. Oh, I don't know. I feel like I might have to have some. So do that piece there. Okay. What are we on? 16. We'll get to the middle. I'll pause. I'll finish off. And then I want to come in with some... Um, like random numbers i would like to get all that lid that would be nice you're probably thinking why you should put in that there because i'm thinking <laughs> i'm thinking that's it so i can do that and let's go in with this blue mm. Yeah. Ooh, I like that. Right, lid. I've got ink all over my fingers. Um not just need uh, some more paper on it but um yeah I'm sure we'll be revisiting revisiting each page next time to to have the next uh, layer oh I like that I don't know if I want any more of that blue or not I think it needs something here I think it just needs a bit more paper so um, oh, I definitely want to stay in here. They've been very messy people, haven't they? Who has <laughs> been looking through this book, putting the coffee cup on every single, well, I like that, uh, every single page. Right. Let's, um, I think I'll have, let's find an, funny sometimes you can just pick out a, a little portion of it and it's you know it sticks out to you but then other times it's a bit, a bit difficult so I'm going to get, get this piece here fancy doing it in the grey Probably be quite a bluey grey, but that's fine. Oh, 
Oh yeah, that's nice. Is coming out, but I think it's because the background's so dark I can see it now. So that's that page. I'm happy with that. So we're in the middle. What what should we do? Um, across here. I'm thinking something across here and then something here. I'm quite fancy. Yep. Yeah using the brown where's that let's just have a look so moved a little bit but it'll be fine oh yeah I like that and um, shall we just have a little one here yes lovely I'm thinking it needs something there but I actually probably think it needs some paper but <coughs> let's do it let's do it anyway because like I say you can cover it cover it over okay so that's that i'm going to pause and finish finish off i'm only going to do exactly um the same because um this is all i've i've got out so i shall see you in a tick okay i'm back i've gone all, all the way through um i'm going to try some of these <coughs> number and letters somebody kindly sent me these um and i don't know who sent them um nobody said to expect anything or there was no note or anything so yeah it, it's a secret <laughs> which is lovely um so these <coughs> um you get a number set obviously i don't know if you buy them together or if they're separate things and letters um, I don't know if they do lowercase as well. These are <coughs> uppercase. And then they all slot together. Um, and then you can do an impression. So I've not tried these out. Um, if it goes terribly wrong, obviously, I can use um, a piece of paper to, to cover it up. I don't know how it will go with <coughs> this book being so, um, you know, uneven and bouncy. But I'll give it a go. I don't know. Oh, I love that. I love the actual numbers. Yeah, that's brilliant. So, let's um, I'll just stamp this off. Let's, um, do, let's do another one. That's a bit. it to to say me isn't it right I think I'm gonna put REF as, as like reference so we want that F E I think this is brilliant. Wrong way, Tanya. And <coughs> where's the art that They click together really uh, securely, but it's not difficult to pull pull them apart. So we'll have <coughs> I fancy it having a nine. I don't know why. That's it. I don't want one on every single 
page. Thinking that or that. All of that. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to be using this loads. Oh, it's brown. Right, that's mine. We've got this. I might as well stamp another one um, the same. So maybe up here. I don't know if that's that. Yeah, brilliant. So <clears throat> that's that. Then we'll go back to, I think we'll just have sort of a large number combination. Three, two, one, say. Oh, no, three, two, nine, oh, one. Okay, pop that there. Yeah, <laughs> it's quite tickling with this. Yeah, these are going to go really well with like my botanical tags and things. Fab. Right, where was we? So we don't want one there. We don't want one there. We've got one there. I'll have one on here. So let's just change it around a little bit. bumpy on that side so we'll have to see oh yeah that's fine I can't believe how nice it stamps so that that is that is that um <clears throat> I did think um you know I could probably decoupage and stuff but I'll see what um what Izzy comes up with next time and we'll we'll take it from there so I will put both of these videos out on the same day and I'll probably just put them, you know, like two hours apart or, or something. So, I mean, I suppose I could put them out at the same time. Yeah. Yeah, so if you if you watch this first, um, this is the wrong one. <laughs> Go and watch the other one. So, yeah. I will. I'll put them out at the at the same same time. So I thought I'd be better splitting it <clears throat> into two because um, you might only want to watch oh, watch one at a one at a time. Um, so yeah, I could do with a little tin to put these in, so I don't have to um, keep putting them back together. But yeah, really love these. So if you're watching and you sent me these, thank you so much. It was so thoughtful because I'm guessing that you did see the video where I was stamping with some um, like peg stamps and um, yeah, I got in a bit of a mess with them. So this will make life so much easier. And if you didn't get yourself one, I, I would definitely uh, go and gift, gift yourself one because they're they're absolutely brilliant so thank you very much for watching and i am eagerly awaiting um is this next video because i'm absolutely loving this and it's fabulous so many of you have said uh that you're doing it uh, which is absolutely uh brilliant and i know quite a few people have come over from Izzy's channel so hello and welcome uh, thanks for joining us and I know some of you guys have gone gone over to Izzy's channel too so that's absolutely fabulous so um, yeah <laughs> I will just um, keep putting these together and um, 
Yeah, I got almost something, something else. So, I think I've got them all. Come on. Right, I'm going. Thanks a lot. See you soon. Bye.